State health officials tell WIT 42 News they are working with doctors to evaluate a few cases of possible Zika virus infection involving patients here in Alabama. And right now, the state health department says there are fewer than five patients being evaluated, but they expect that number to rise. At the moment, there are no known cases of the Zika virus in Alabama, but the mosquito-borne virus continues to spread across Central and South America. There are a number of cases in the United States, but all are linked to patients who caught the disease in other countries. That's according to the CDC. Now, health authorities believe the virus may be linked to birth defects, and pregnant women are being urged not to travel to affected areas. Doctors here in Alabama are on high alert. It doesn't do major damage to the host, to the person who has the virus, but the, the babies the, that are being born are, are just, it's awful what's happening. Goodness, now the state health department says all pregnant patients who have traveled to affected areas should be evaluated for the Zika virus. Only one in five people bitten will get sick, and people may not know that they've even been infected. To learn more about those symptoms and signs of the virus, you can go to our website, WIAT.com.